Welcome to my greenhouse. I'm here with Michelle, who works with Solex Greenhouses, which mm -hmm. is what this one is. We're standing in an eight by eight by six foot tall greenhouse, simple to put together. You tell me, why would I, why would I want a greenhouse? Well, fall is a perfect time to start a greenhouse, and there are a couple of reasons. The weather is still nice, so it's a good time to build it, mm -hmm. and also it's really easy to overwinter containers. And, and what benefit does that give you? Well, a couple things. If you overwinter a container, you get a little earlier start in the spring, mm -hmm. and that means you don't have to repot it. It means that you don't have to start over. You get a plant that's healthier and is last longer. And, and bigger. And bigger. And the money that you save, you can go and buy more <laughs> and plants. Buy more plants. <laughs> exactly. Which every garden center is going to love you for that. So, <laughs> and so you can also, I, I would assume, you know, start seeds, vegetables, flowers, whatever it is. You, you have the benefit of doing that. Mm -hmm. And these are a really a lightweight easy thing to do and mm -hmm. we're going to build one. We are. So why don't we uh, mosey on down there now okay. and uh, we'll, we'll start building a greenhouse. Now Michelle, right here, this is what you get in the mail when you order a Solex greenhouse. Yes. It, it, it's not that intimidating. <laughs> no, there really aren't that many parts. So really, and they don't use a lot of, of tools. No. Um, a few tools, there's some caulking that you use for the panels and a drill. Now. Right over here, you've already set up the footprint for this one that we're going to put together today. And one of the things that I think is, is wonderful about these is, of course, you can be as, you know, as prepared as you want to be with gravel, shade cloth, weed barrier, all of that mm -hmm. stuff. But you really also can set it pretty much anywhere. You can. Um, the base is actually a hard composite frame, so it's very strong. And once the greenhouse is built, you can pick it up and move it. And you can build it on a site that has very little preparation at all. Or, if you'd like, you could add a, a weed barrier and gravel to give you additional drainage, but you don't have to. But the key here is, is it's so simple. I mean, it's a really simple process. So, let's get started. Let's build us a greenhouse, shall we? Okay. All right. There. So now, granted, Michelle, th th there was some pre-assembling done on these little gigs, but really, how long did it take us to put this frame up? This was about 10 minutes. Now see, you, and you, it's, it, it was simple. And you do have you know, details and instructions, but I have the benefit of having you here, so eh, we're just gonna toss those aside <laughs> and go forward. Now, the next step, the really important step, it does take another person helping you because up to this point, you could have done it all alone, mm -hmm. are these. What, what are they and what are we going to do with them? These are the hanging rods, and now we're going to attach the hanging rods to the door assembly and the back vent assembly. And once it's completed, it's going to give the structure and support, and then you can hang plants on them. So you probably want me over there, don't you? Sure. Okay, let me run over there. And, all right, what do I do? Just insert the pipe until it bottoms out, and tighten. Just like that. <laughs> and now we're just going to slide on the H trim. It's really quite simplistic, isn't it? It is. We like simple stuff. <laughs> So now we've got the one side done. Mm -hmm. We'll do the other side, which is pretty much just a replication of this. The ends will be on. Yep. Let's do this. And then we're done. <laughs> All right. <laughs> and we're done with your help. It, wa it was very, very easy. Mm -hmm. um, now, one of the things we were talking about is these are really lightweight. Let let's show them how lightweight they are. <laughs> I can't believe that I feel strong, and really I'm not. <laughs> and another thing too, Michelle, was you were telling me that they're great for like if you have a, if you want to start a vegetable garden early or extend the life of your tomatoes, mm -hmm. I by myself could pick this up and set it over my tomatoes spring or fall, either one. Exactly, and then you can move it when you're done. That's such a great idea. Now you guys have a, a website. We do. You, and what is that? It's greenhousecatalog.com. Greenhousecatalog.com. Mm -hmm. And a lot of different choices, not just this one choice. There's a lot of them. Correct. So, you know, if you if you forget their website, you can always go to gardentime.tv. We'll kick you over to it. What a pleasure it's been. Let's 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 build some more greenhouses. Okay, right, sounds thanks, great. Michelle. Thank you.